Welcome back to Just Off the Plate. It is episode 54. We are live on a Tuesday. We are in springtime. This is Armando. I am Cody. Just us two tonight. How are you, sir? Fantastic, man. Good to know. Good to hear. Are you still sore from your five-day, four-day game? A four-day game streak. Um, yes, I'm super sore today. I bet, dude. And I'm lazy, so don't expect much out of me. <laughs> <laughs> we're definitely, we're definitely uh, ballers for sure, man. A lot of baseball in a short period of time. And you should have had four, but you didn't? I didn't yeah. see your name in the lineup for Sunday? <laughs> I mean, I did check a little bit of, you know, I did have some time to, to, to check to look, to, look stats. That, to look at that stat, huh? Yeah, but I didn't, you know, nothing to look up. No, and, you know, you know me, I'd rather play than watch, but I made a sacrifice this Sunday for the viewers, and I went to go do the uh, Sunday, Sunday AAA Oretta championship game live. And uh, that was a smart choice. Great game. Great game. Right? We like Lego Oretta. Congratulations to the Bombers. Congratulations to the Bombers. What's up, Sergio? What's up, Bo? What's up, Ronte? Yeah, it was um, it was a good game. It was it was a it was a, it was a beautiful day because you had a game too that Sunday, correct? Yeah, it was nice all weekend. Right. It was good game. For, it was a good day for baseball. Um, as well as the evenings, Friday night, Monday night. Monday night. Yeah, yeah. it was great. It was great weather. It wasn't too cold. Just right. Um, this is definitely the kind of weather I've been waiting for now. Hey, it's springtime. It's springtime, man. So it's, it's, uh, they don't like, call it spring training for nothing. <laughs> right. Yeah, man. It's, 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 uh, summer training. No, sir. I know, man. <laughs> and, 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 you know, some of those days were caught, like it was actually, it was a really good breeze, uh, on Sunday. I remember I went out there, you know, I don't like the cold, right? So I go out there with like a tank top, right? I need to get a little bit of, get a little bit of brown on my skin. I was like, man, I kind of brought, I brought a lightweight jacket just in case, and I'm glad I did because it was a little breezy. So yeah. it worked out pretty good. Plus, you want to cover those tattoos at times. <laughs> it, it could be a little intimidating to certain people. I ain't going to lie. When I was walking behind some people, they, they kind of turned around like, who the fuck is this guy? <laughs> What's up, Hector? You, you do command a double take sometimes. So I right? do. I do. They, they do. But I will say this. I will say this. Uh, the other day, I, I was getting out of my car. Lino, what's up, man? Um... And I see this savory character in the parking lot. And as I'm walking, getting out of my vehicle, and I'm, this is like me coming out of work, he looks at me and goes, excuse me, sir. He goes, uh, are you an attorney? And I said, I looked down. And I thought he was messing with me, right? And I looked down up a little bit. I said, nah. <laughs> Continue. I mean, the show must go on. What are you doing? Sorry. I'm sorry. I just got off. Go on, Chris Rock. Let's go. Let's go. Yeah, right? Let's go. Ba -ba -ba. <laughs> um yeah so he tells me because you know attorney so i got that flip side right i got the side where like you think i'm gonna probably rob you and then i got you got the other side that hey man this guy might be able to help me on my case just depends on what time of day when you see me okay <laughs> yeah so <laughs> salvador he said can we hear what's your y'all's opinion on hba's upcoming saturday game yeah man definitely we'll uh We'll look. We'll look at see what's coming up. The forecasted games. The forecasted games. See what. See what. See what. Uh, we we. Uh, what knowledge we have. We'll see what the. What we call it. Um, the main event. The the Saturday night game. The prime time. The prime. There you go. Prime time. What's up, Dre? What's up, uh, Cameron? Yeah, for sure. I mean, we might as well, right? We I, talked about last week's. We did. But we don't really get into what's next. So. Yeah, I mean it's it's um. And unless it's kind of getting towards the end, right, where it's like a make or break. Hey, like if this guy, these team wins, then then they go into playoffs or whatever. But but what's great and interesting is that there's so many good teams. I think there's, you know, no one's undefeated anymore. But I, I want to say there's six or seven teams that are four and one. Right, right, yeah. right, right. And we're not one of them. Yeah, no. <laughs> <laughs> we're getting a little better. What's up, Jose? Yeah, we're getting a little bit better, um, for sure. But you know, it's 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 uh. It's, uh, you know, the name of the game. I mean, you know, uh, you know, going back to, to the championship game here this weekend for Ligo Red Eye, you know, I mean, Ramones is a great team. Bombers is a great team. I did not expect a 14-4 to win on the first game. I mean, it's a blowout, right? And it's kind of interesting because last, when I was watching what I think last, like, summer's AAA championship, it was what uh, um, Los Ramones and Hot Shots, and the uh, first game was a blowout. 
I mean, first game was like, hey, man, you know, like, what is what, are we, what am I watching here? Double right? elimination. Double elimination. And so okay. the second game in both of these championships were nail biters. Mm-hmm. You know, the, you know, um, Sergio walked it off with with that single to left field in in, in, in the hot shots last summer, and um, this one here wasn't necessarily a walk off, but you know, it was looking like it was going to be a game three, like they were going to split. You know, I feel like at some point when you're doing that first game right, and you know you have another game, and all of a sudden you're getting doubled up on runs, and it's eight to four, you might kind of start thinking about that second game. Yeah, letting your foot off the gas. Okay, let me, I'm not going to use this pitcher. You know, let me let me find somebody that can you know burn some innings and get some outs to save them for that next game. And, and I think, uh, what's up, Jimmy? Uh, you know, and I think that's that's I think the correct mentality. I mean, you know, when we, uh, you know, if anybody from the Ramones wants to chime in, you know, and and kind of say their 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 thought, but um, or anybody who's been in that doubleheader that gets um, that gets blown out, then you know. Um, uh, chime in and kind of say what well, you because I, I kind of agree with you yeah I, I would say that if I knew I was getting blown on the first game I would say yeah let me take kind of take it easy and as a coach you're like I'm not going to start wasting pitchers but you know even if it's trending in that direction right if you have guys that you know should be swinging well and they're not right and then suddenly you're down four runs maybe you're thinking okay we don't like this guy the opponent's pitcher we're, we're going to wait and, and, and see the other guy see who they throw at us yeah Right next, so I mean, so who who had the advantage? Right? Have they they both lost? Obviously, somebody had lost, right? No. So this was the first game in a in a, in a three game series. Okay. They, so oh, they, that's right. So, so they, they do the series. They, they, yeah, they do the series, three game series, and they always start off with versus a double header. Okay. You know, and so. Um, now, sometimes, sometimes it's not that way. I mean, sometimes you, you get into, you know, oh, well, you played the playoff game and you have to lose that one or win that one to see who wins the championship. And they might get started. That second game might be the start of the championship. But in this specific case, it was, hey, both games are going to be played. The first two games are going to be played the same day in the championship game. And, and, and um, you know, again, the, the first game just didn't look good. I yeah. mean, it was not the type of game I was looking for as a, as a fan, you know, looking at the game. Um, you know, credit to the to the you know bombers. I mean, they came out swinging. I, mean, I think they went up four zero in the first inning, and I mean they were just hitting everything, right? So then you start. To, and my mind goes, well, I'm not familiar with uh, any of these pitchers or any teams specifically on you know what pitchers are which, but theoretically you throw your ace anyways. In my mind, you throw your ace at the first game because you're trying to get the first game yeah. one. So if these guys are smashing your ace. Like, what's the hope for the rest of the other guys, you know? And so, but they put, but I, uh, you know, the, the Ramones pulled it together in the second game. I mean, you know, to lose 14 to four and then come back and, 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 you know, have, have the, uh, the game almost, you know, almost tied up. You know, I mean, almost, uh, you know, looking forward to the third game yeah. because they, they're going to get it. Um, it's, 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 it's pretty incredible. Well, that's when you give credit to guys who, who, who understand the game, right? Say this, this is a deciding game we need to play right mm-hmm. the first game yeah we could lose it and still win this thing right yeah but once you get to that elimination game like okay that's when you know you're you're a ball player when you you're in that position and you come to play yeah and you almost win that game yeah i mean it's 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 uh like deep down you know like hey we got to do this or else we're going home <laughs> yes yeah you know, I think, and that's a test because they did that before, right? Or at least the last series was like that. Yes, it was. It was like that. It's like you know when it's time to play. Yeah, it's it's time to turn it up. And yeah. and, and 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 here's what um was awesome is they started the second game with I think the leadoff hitter hitting a bomb on the first. I'm not. Now I wasn't think it was the first pitch, but it was the first at bat. Yeah. So I mean, um, that kind of said, hey, set the tone a little bit, right? Mm-hmm. Like, hey, we're we're here to play. Like, let's go. So um, it, it was definitely uh, an exciting game. Oh, we got Pedro Rivera. What's up, Pedro? Um, see, you know, you don't you don't have the roster to win both games. You got to face focus on winning one game to go to the game three. Yeah, it's true. So you know, uh, Bo says if you know you don't have the the roster to win both games, you got to focus on winning game one to go to game three. Mm-hmm. Right. That that's actually pretty good um, analysis, right? If you don't got the depth to do both at the double header, you're like, all right, I, if I'm gonna lose one, I gotta lose. Uh, you know the second one, not the first one. Right. That way we can push a game three. So that that does make sense. Um, 
<laughs> traduce yeah so he's like hey translate hey my bad guys you know <laughs> no <laughs> if you get somebody out there to translate for us man i apologize i know um we've been talking about trying to get this thing to uh do the sap button so that it translate over i wonder what kind of voice you would have cody if they did this uh in, in spanish that'd be interesting to see <laughs> right yeah <laughs> like when you watch it have you ever watched just a classic movie in spanish just for the hell of it yes i have <laughs> is it funny to you yeah <laughs> well actually that's a good way to learn another language to it watch really a is. movie you already know and then read the subtitles. I right? agree with that. Yeah. yeah, especially one that you know the lines on, right? Like, sure. you imagine you watch uh, the Lebowski in in Spanish. You know, like you just like <laughs> it would just sound funny to you. Well, I'm gonna I would start quoting it in Spanish. <laughs> <laughs> so we might see that. We might see that. All right, man. Um, yeah, I wish we could we could help you out. We're yeah, just, we're not that advanced yet. Not yet. Not yet. But definitely, you know, so, at some point we'll probably get something to to help the people that uh, to know. But definitely um let's get um before we get into all the weekend stuff and and whatever um let's let's uh not keep um let's not keep them waiting now uh, so we're gonna we're gonna call um daniel muñoz okay um he's uh he's um the um the manager the manager for the bombers uh very young uh i'm not sure how old he is but he's very very young and a uh, first time manager so first time manager, first time championship. Oh wow! Now first time championship as a manager. Now uh, a little known fact: he is a Sat HPA Saturday Cyclone. So I don't know if he's playing with them this year, but he did. He was there in the champion roster last year or last season, I should say. So he's not. He's no. Uh, he's not uh, shy or, or or he reckon he knows what it takes to win a championship. Yeah, he so, he's not new to this. He's not new to this, man. So. Despite his age. Exactly. So um, it was definitely uh, interesting watching him, watching him coach here. So give me a little, little second here. Boom, 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 boom. Let's see here. Let's see. Daniel, Daniel Munoz, and here we go. Hello, Daniel. Yes, sir. How you doing today? This is this is our monopoly just off the plate. Hey, what's up, Daniel? It's Cody. Uh, oh man, hey, hey. Uh, first of all, man, I, I just want to to thank you, man. Uh, you know, for the. Uh, you hear me? Yeah, we can hear you. Uh, uh, all right, all right, all right, all right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Can y'all hear me? Yes, yeah. sir. Yes, sir. We got you. Can you hear okay. us? Okay. Okay. Yeah. 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 I hear you. I hear you now. Okay. Yeah, something going on with my Bluetooth. Hey. Uh. What I say, man. First of all, I, I just want to thank you, man, for the opportunity. Uh. Y'all being man to be on the, on y'all postcard, man. You know. It's. Uh. I'm very excited, man. I'm very excited. It's my first time on this. Uh. Uh. What I can tell you, man. I'm happy, man. Well, oh, hey, you, you earned it. You earned it, right? You earned the spot to be here. Congratulations yeah. on the wins. Yeah, congratulations, you, man. man. I appreciate it. I appreciate it. And you and you got a lot of fans on here. There's a lot. Of, there's a lot of new. <laughs> there's a lot of new uh, names I don't recognize. Uh, they're already asking me to translate. And there's I, a lot of words I don't recognize. <laughs> I do recognize yeah. most, but there are some. <laughs> and you know, I, I wish I could help out. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. So you got a lot of your your you know your fans, your teammates on here. And um, yeah. you know, and I appreciate you taking the time to to talk to us. But like like Cody said, you you earned a spot here. I mean, we tried to highlight um, all the managers that that win a championship in any league um, to 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 uh, give us a breakdown, you know, of the game, you know, and kind of go through sorry. strategies and and you know, shout out their players and and, and stuff. So um, so this is this is what I'm, so. Let me ask you this, Daniel. So when, when you when when uh, I know and I, and I was there at the beginning. Uh, you know, when I got to the game, you know, I saw you in your huddle. You were, you were pumping up your guys. What what were you telling them? Um, what were you telling them to get them going? All right. Uh, you're talking about after inning, every time after inning. No, no. Uh, like, before before the before the game got started. Before right before oh, the game. Before. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Hey, uh, what I told him is, uh, you know, uh, some players got some idea. The other one got other idea, right? So what I've been working on, on, on every game, you know what I'm saying, is uh, put, put all ideas together. And it's what I make a conversation all the time with him. What I tell him before that very important uh, game, uh, for me, it's the most important. Some players, they've been playing, you know, another uh, really good game. But for me, it's the most important, right? I told him uh, some 
guys say, hey, let, let's win, let's win the first game, right? Let's win the first game, and uh, team, uh, later we can concentrate on the second one because uh, I agree with him, right? So it's what I tell the same thing. Hey, I think the same thing. We gotta win this game. We gotta make it sure we win the first one, man. Let's go win the the, the first one later. We go and work with the second one, right? Uh, is how we are starting, right? I told him, hey, uh, this is a really good team, right? Don't think like y'all go win easy, whatever. Uh, if it that happen, oh, it's it's really cool, right? But I respect the team against me all the time, right? It's, it doesn't matter if it's uh, Ramones, uh, Cardinals, uh, whoever. It's, it doesn't matter. I respect everything, right? Because it's it baseball, man. And you never know what happens. So I, I, I'm not going to play with it. You know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm not going to take a chance with nobody. We, I, I go, I go, I, I go win, man. It's, it's, you know what I'm saying? So yeah, that way, if he, if he any team that uh, beat me, whatever, it's not justified, man. I, I do the best I can. You, you beat me, man. It's not justified. So it's what I tell them. Uh, let's win this four game. It's going to be a small game. Y'all got to be the small on the field, man. Y'all, you know say Y'all got to be concentrate. I'm going to be on, on towards Bay. Let's try to follow what, you know, what, what I say on the, on the, on the towards base. And um, let, let's try. Let, let let's go get this game. Let, now, now let's try, right? Let, let's go get this game because let's try. No, no, I, I never say that on on the field. They they already know what's going on. Let's go get the game for sure, 100 percent. And uh, they good man. They they agree with me and and they with me all the time. That that's what happened. Yeah, I mean, you know, when 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 I was, you know, I saw you. You get you. You know, you got your you you pumping up your team and and you were talking to them. And, and and whatever you did, it worked because I mean, I, I can't. I don't have the the you know the 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 scorebook or anything. But I I, I mean your your hitters. Uh, first off, I think you got four or five runs in the first inning, and I don't know how many hits they got. They got a lot of hits. I mean, they were just hitting, like they they were just hitting every ball, singles, doubles, singles, doubles, singles, doubles. I mean, it was just like shot after shot after shot after shot. So they came out swinging. And um, right. you know they did they did a good job. So whatever you told them got them motivated for sure. Right, 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 right. Because uh, I tell you, know, first of all, I tell like like uh, play a small game and play ba real baseball, right? Hey, we got a boom, we got steal bases, we got any chance, man. We got to make runs. We we don't know how the game is going because they got a really good pitcher. I believe, I believe hundred percent of my hitters, man. But you know. Uh, that type of game, that type of game right there, man. You know, so you gotta, you gotta think and everything, and uh, you gotta start think. You gotta start play as more, right? You, so you start as more. So the game go tell you what you need to do, right? So you gotta. That, that's why you gotta be focused all the time, watch everything because the game go tell you. It's, it's like, a, it's like I tell my guys, man. Listen, this is the game. So, so let. Just play, bro. Don't, don't stress it. Play. It's like you go to Oklahoma Casino. It's, it's a game. Man. It's another game. Yeah. It's baseball, right? It's not blackjack, but it's a game, bro. You know what I'm yeah. saying? So watch. Watch the move. Watch everything. So the game go tell you what's going to be the next move. Baseball can't do that. Baseball can't tell you what you have to do. What's your next move, right? So, But you have to be focused. To know that, right? So I tell them, hey, let's start play as more. Let's try watch the pitcher, what he does. So, but if he, like, he's on me, right? So they they follow me. Like if I start to say, hey, no bone, let's hit, let's hit, because they they let me do that. Oh no, I go I go I go make 20 runs, right? For sure, you. It, it, so I, I, you know, I tell, I respect you. For, for, I, I respect you from the right. I got respect for you. I start. You know, I think you're a good team, so I'm going to start to bone, like, make one run, whatever, see what's going on. But if I see I'm going to start hit it easy, whatever, I say, no, 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 hold on, hold on. Let, 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 let's hit, let's hit. Let's do what, what we do, man. It's, it's, it's what we bombers. So let's do it. <laughs> so that, that's what happened on the first game. Yeah. Yeah. That, that first game, it's so critical, right? I mean, w once you win, then your back's not up against the wall, and you really are in the driver's seat. So, you know, that's always good that, hey, you get your guys you going like we got it. We get let's get this first game and then, you know, we stand a really good chance to win this thing. So did you did you throw your 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 best guy in that first game? I'm I'm assuming you did. 
Oh, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm never going to do that mistake. I'm always, I'm always like, like, suppose I go play a, uh, a game next Sunday, right? Suppose, uh, okay, this, this championship finish. Let, let's suppose, uh, suppose we go play another championship this Sunday, okay? Yeah. Because the championship is going to be Sunday, right? So suppose uh, Ramon is, is going to be Ramon as a game, uh, three out of two, okay? Yeah, cool. So they know I go bring my best guy. So yeah. they go bring another one. Right. If you if you do that, oh, I, I went before start play because uh, you don't go bring your best guy against my best guy. Oh, so you told me I go win for sure. So I'm always, always I go bring my best pitcher all the time. So I got a guarantee. You know what I'm saying? So I go win that first game because on the second game, oh, anything is can happen. Anything yeah. is yeah. can happen. Because if you do win that first one, then you know you're guaranteed at least another day at if least you need that. it. Yeah. yeah, yeah. And 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 one thing, um, one thing, Daniel, that I did like about when I saw um, that you were you were pumping up your guys, and then when um, um. Uh, when when things were kind of getting out of hand, right? Like you know, a call didn't go your way, or something something happened that they the players didn't like. Um, that you went and calmed them down. You went over there and said, "Hey, calm down. You know, calm down. It's okay. Relax. Let it go. Forget about it. Let's go to the next play." And so I thought that was. I noticed you kept doing that because you know you know the players were getting excited. It's a championship game, I, and I understand that. But I noticed that you kept calming them down, and I think that's a that's a really good thing. That sometimes, if you don't get that under control. Then your your team can fall apart, right? Because they start to fight with each other or or, or whatever, and, and and then they're not focused on the game. So I think that was, I think that did that did you a lot of good. Right, you're talking about second game, right? Well, I I, I saw it in the first game too. Like in the first game, there was there were some issues. Like I saw that. I don't re- I don't remember what happened. I know it happened in the second game too, but I know like in the first game yeah. there were some things and, and and the players were coming out of the dugout and you told them, hey, get back in there, get back in there, just relax, oh, you know. Yeah. You know, yeah, so. yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, that okay. Uh, before the games start, right? Uh, when when the blue say the rules and all that, uh, I, I I talked to the other manager, right? Because um, I got really respect. I got better respect for the for the manager. I mean, for every manager, right? But I tell him, hey, hey, man, hey, listen, we we play hard, man. We we play uh, real baseball, uh, and and we mains anyway. So. Uh, I know for sure some some things happen because they, I know I know that happened on the field, man. I tell you, but hey, I go control my people. You control your people because I try play the best baseball. Yeah, we can play on on this league, right? It's, it's what I'm trying to do today, man. Like, do the best show, the best and clean baseball we can do, right? I don't try to do anything different, right? So try control the people. So I try keep the control all the time. Sometimes it's hard to me because the people know me, man. I'm not a guy like come down all the time. No, no, no. They, but I know I got to make a force for my team because they will follow me, man. So it's a, it's a, it's, that's a big job for me. That That's that's the the, the, the hard job. If you ask me, hey, Danny, what, what's, the, the, what, what's the hard job you've been doing with, with your team? Man, it's my, it's my, uh, me personal. You know what I'm saying? My, my personality is, is like, 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 change my, 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 my mind, whatever. Because I'm hard to right? So, but uh, you know, they, they, they will follow me. So I gotta calm down first. Then I gotta work with the team. Hey, man, this is not the idea. So let's play. Let, let's that go. Let's keep play baseball. Um, yeah, and they I mean, good, man. They 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 listen to me, so that's what I like it. They listen to me, man. They well, that's me. good. I mean, because a lot of guys don't, right? You, yeah. you get egos in the way, and yeah. some guys are just they're hard to control. It right? is, and I and I and I was watching, and you know, like I said, it got a little bit a little bit crazy, but then he calmed them down, and he told them, "Hey, man, you know, let it go. Let me let me talk to the umpires. Let me do that. Just relax. I already talked to the umpires. Calm down. You know, let it go." And so I think that really, I think helped them focus. On, on definitely finishing off the, 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 the first game. You know, the first game, you know, went, went really well. I mean, you know, 14-4, to four, I mean, it's a great lead. You know, you can kind of, you know, keep your, you know, keep, keep yourself, keep the gas off the, you know, take your pedal off the gas and, and uh, keep your foot off the gas, I'm sorry, and, um, and kind of cruise and go into the second game, you know, and kind of save yourself. And sub in some guys. Sub maybe. in some yeah. guys, you know, and, and, and uh, let them get some hits and, and, you know, get, you know, get them ready for the second game, you know. And you know, in, in in the second game, 
was very close, right? They start off with the home run, and and then they go up. I think I don't remember. They went up. I don't know if at the third or fourth inning, but they went up like, you know, three to zero. You know, and it was three to zero yeah. for a while. And sure, and sure. right. And um, when you when you were up three to when they were up three to zero, and um and and and, and uh, what what did you think? Did you think, hey man, we're gonna probably go to game three, or you're like, hey, we could still do this. We could still no, win. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. I never thought on game three. That, that, that's what got me stressing, right? And yeah. For the, for the little bit and about inning six to inning eight, about three innings, I lost, I lost the, 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 the control, man. My blood pressure go high. They put some ice on my, on my neck. <laughs> they, uh, my brother, my brother uh, gives some uh, blood pressure pills. And I say no, that because my players talking about it. Towards game and I got some play half okay half of the team say hey don't worry about it they again is the wall they again is whoa you for real Ramon is against whoa you try give it a chance you try take a chance to gain three you really know it's it's like somebody die and you try to uh, to bring him to life or something like that do you understand do you understand what I'm talking about like somebody die already and you try like like hey Revive them. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, no, no. They die already. In the well, because, yeah. We, we got to finish them here. Bro. You, They that would is. have momentum if they win that second game, right? So all of a sudden they got some momentum carrying it hey. into the third game. And, yeah, that that's definitely what you don't want to give up. If hey, if you see if you see on fourth game, I'm, I'm, you know, I move some players when I know for sure it's almost impossible they they – they beat me right because I got the best pitcher on the league. So I say that it's, it's almost impossible, right? It's when I pull like about about uh, two, three people on the bench for the second game, right? Why I say that? Because I thought they go fight to the end, right? Yeah. So I, I know they fight to the end. If I know that, right, on the first game, how you think I will take a chance for a game three? No, I don't want to see that movie. I, you know what I'm saying? I, I, <laughs> wanna, I, I wanna finish here. This is yes. my movie, man, today. So we gotta finish in here. We we can, yeah, we can. So uh, the preacher for a second game, man, he did really good. I like when 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 day for hit hit a home run and he say, okay, nothing happened. Let's go. I can. Yeah. And that, you know. You know, one thing, one thing, I'm, I'm um, um, I want to talk about. Um, Adrian kind of brought it up and um. You know, I think it was the seventh or eighth inning, right? You know, you guys had some, um, you guys had had some runners on, and um, you know, and th- this is what I saw. You know, and if anybody wants to chime in, that was there. You know, anybody who's uh, listening in can chime in. But um, the guy, they hit it the second. It was a, it was, a, it was a hard grounder, and um, Adrian Alo, you know, charged it, and it looked like it took a bad hop. Because I saw Alo kind of—I don't remember if he, he he moved to his right or he moved to his left, but it looked like it took a bad hop. Well, you know, yeah, I the, think it was about his right. Yeah, his right side, right. And it took to me, yeah, it looked like yeah. it took a bad hop, right? And yeah. the the ball goes all the way to the fence, right? But in my eyes, the right fielder didn't do anything. You know, the right fielder just kind of stood there because that ball should have never hit the fence. A ground ball should never go to the fence because. When the ball's hit to second, the right fielder is supposed to come behind it just in case it gets past the infield. And that right fielder didn't even move. And, you know, it took him a long time to finally get moving. And that allowed your, your guys to, run, you, know, t- you know, I think they tied up the game or, or, the, or, the, or, the, or the, they got two runs in. And that ball went all the way to the fence. And then um, the, the guy who hit the ball, they tried to throw it back to, to, to second somehow. And it went over his head. Adrian uh, Alo's head again, and again the the right fielder didn't do anything, and the 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 hitter was was really excited, right, and didn't pay attention right. that the ball floated to right field oh. and he could have made it to third. Okay. He was so excited, everybody's yelling at pumped him to up. go, pumped yeah. up. Everybody's like, hey, go go go! But he's thinking they're just yelling like, yeah yeah yeah, and he didn't move. Now, luckily. That didn't cost you the game, right? Because I think that if it had had the Bombers lost the game, I think you could have pointed to that and saying, "Hey, man, you, you yes, I'm um, thank you for hitting the ball through, but you, 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 the game is not over. You should have been paying attention. You could have been at third base." So um, I know, I know, I saw you 
at third base trying to wave him to you know to go to third but he didn't go right did what did he say right. about that yeah what did he say about that yeah uh hey yeah he he's he's going at the end yeah he's going he's, he, that that run he said that was the run number fifth because he's so exciting like like <laughs> you say right with the with the with uh with that line right yeah that with, with that hit man and and he celebrated on the second base. I say, come on, man. Come on. <laughs> Damn, he can hear me. He celebrate a little too because, early. Yes. Yeah. My, my boys, man, he's, he's, you know, he's so, it was so bad, man, because I've been talking high all day. I say, Damn, come on, man. Yeah, yeah. Come on, man. What are you doing? <laughs> and, and, you know, he take a reaction and he come to the first base and he passed it towards the base. I say, man, come back to the base, man. <laughs> uh, but I understand, right? But I, I got to talk to him like that because, uh, you know, he got to be focused. Yes, sir. I say, hey, man, hey, calm down a little bit, man. Hey, listen, the guy behind you, Edward, Edward, you got to pay attention. He, he going to hit to the, to, to the, uh, to the outfield, right? So gotta, you got to be on base, man. You got to be on base, bro. It's okay, so, okay, okay, man. Yeah, yeah, let's do it. Okay. So that's exactly what happened. Edward hit uh, a fly, uh, fly balls back to the left field to Juan, right? So he take it, uh, and they, that run score, that was the wrong number, the wrong number. Uh, three, three, number right? Number fifth. Yeah, number fifth. Yep. Number five. Yeah. Number five. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, I mean, and, 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 and you know, and, and um, I think that's good that you talk to your, your base runner, right? Because sometimes, like you said, they get excited, right? So if you don't tell them, hey, this is this is what's going to happen. This is what I need you to do. I need you to tag up or whatever. If you don't tell them that, that could cost you the game. And, and, and I think, um, you know, I think that's smart of you to do that because, you know, you you saw that runner. I mean, he, anybody would be excited to, to, to score two runs in when you're, when you're, when you're, when you're, um, when you're down. And, and, you know, he just kind of lost his head a little bit, right? And you had, to, like you said, you had to focus him and, hey, focus, focus. I need you to be smart about this and because we can't get doubled up or you can't, you know. Um, well, those extra 90 feet is critical in, yeah. in a close game, right? Very and much you so. you got to take everything you can. Yeah, especially when you have right. to go out and move on a sack fly, right? You, yeah, you gotta yeah. Sack fly, you got to be looking for those errors, yeah, right? Looking yeah. for any way to get to that next pass. Yeah, next 90 feet. You yeah. know, I think um, – Jay-Z uh, from the Hotshots used to call it the free 90, you know, free 90. You give up free 90s when you make errors, you just give them yeah. another 90 feet. So, uh, but, you know, the, the so you you got him to score, right? And then uh, I remember you brought in this young pitcher. He came in and, and he was, you know, he was holding him. He was holding him down and um, did, and then you made, you made a switch, right? You made a switch, you brought in your closer. Um, why, why did you do that? What, what was your thought behind that? Okay. Uh, all right. Yeah, I believe. I believe. Uh, hey, my 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 youngest pitcher, that that guy Nico. His name is Nico Garcia. Nico. Hey, hey, he, he did really good, man. I, I'm so proud about him. Hey, I like uh, for real, man. I like what he did, man. He, he did a like, great, great job, man. He won the game, man. It he, he was really good, man. I know. I feel him, right? He won't finish. I know he won't finish, man. I know he won't finish. He ready. It's, it's, what, oh, yeah. it's, what, I, it's what I see. It's what I like it. It's what I like it because if you pull Houston Astro there, he will pitch. Definitely. He, he will yeah. pitch. It doesn't matter if it's Boston Astro. <laughs> yeah, the, the only thing he you knows is, hey, I will finish this, man. I, yeah. I, I know that, right? I feel that. But you know what? Sometimes it's not what you want. It's what the team need, man. I, good, I, I good, think, good, I, good, 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 good. I think all the time, and what what my team need because if yep. we are not do that, like coach, how I go tell my players, hey, play for the team. If they say, hey, coach, but you 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 play personal, you you never think on those. So, so I know the time. All the time, you gotta be around the team, man. You never. If you never can lose your mind, and you know what I'm saying, it's got to be everything on team. All right, what, what, what I say that, okay? Because he's been doing a great job, but this is the thing. Ramon's make a run on inning before they make they, – the game was at 3-2, right? Yeah. And then Ramon's, they make another run. They, they put the game uh 4-2. I said, the inning before that, that happened, right? Yeah. I said, damn. Okay, okay, that that's good. But I tell I tell Jose, right, Jose, start through uh my 
uh, Jose, my the guy who's won the first the first game. I'm yeah. all about they, they, that's my MVP, man. That, that that's it. Hey, it's not scared to say that's the best pitcher of the league, man. So, awesome. Hey, whatever, whatever. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Hey, I got my best pitcher right. And I say, hey, man, I'm ready to go, man. I, I'm ready to go. And he start through some balls. I say, what are you doing, Jose? He say, man, I'm I'm, I'm doing you know I'm through some balls just in case I got it. Hey, man, we lost. I don't got no more pitcher. Okay, who goes next? Is if he not make, I say I go, I go, but not you, man, because it's a main sentence. I, I'm still lost, right? But hey, if the game going tight or up, hey, you go for sure, you go. Yeah. Say, All right. I say okay. Jose was ready, okay, for that three out. I told the young, hey, Jose, come, okay, why? The the question you made me, why? Why Jose? Why you don't let him finish? Hey, yeah. I, Jose, uh, I used to, uh, he used to believe on, on, on my town, on Cuba, and it's a big history before the, before this. When I was young, about 12, 14 years old, my father bring me to the stadium. Then, who, do you know who I'm watching over there preaching? No. It was a Jose with a full stadium with thousand people telling everything, right? Pressure wow. games, and he, he not pressure, he been playing professional in Cuba. That's the guy for that moment, all right? Nico told me he want, he want, he want to do it, right? Uh, he, his chance, whatever, is going to maybe come in, this is to come in another day, but not that day against Ramon's, because Ramon's, they, they, they ready to make that wrong. They ready to make that wrong. But when they see, I bring Jose to pitch, I move the other youngest man, Look their face. They say, no, they see. They see. We look okay. ready. Uh, that, that, that what was happening. I tell you, they, they good team, like I say. But when I, when I made that move, they see, right. Because uh, Nico needs some more experience. That's the answer. I need some more experience. He got to show me uh, like a little bit more, man. Like, like, like me, sometimes, yeah, you, you make it, you know, uh, I see you was forced, right? You was forced to do something, but I just want to see the the the, the results, right? Like 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 then I'm trying, but I'm not make it. But, but I'm trying, I'm trying. Yeah, but you not make it. No, but I'm trying. Yeah, it's good, but you not make it, man. I need to, you make it. Right? Yeah. So that's not the game to see if he. <laughs> it's a fight now, man. I, Man, I'm not gonna take a chance. Let's do it another day. So that, that's fine. But not not today. He go told me. I know he go told me. He go, but it's not gonna be that day, man. So he go told me another day. So that, yeah, no, I, you know, and, and and here's the thing, you know, Daniel, that I think uh, people forget. Okay, you need a lot of players to win a championship, especially when the, the double header. Everybody has to play their part, you know, and sometimes. Your part right. is is a, is a is a is a very specific and maybe a short part, right? Maybe you only pitch a few innings. Maybe you only go hit a few innings. Maybe you only go uh, play defense for a few innings. But that's your part. Maybe you pinch run because you're fast, like like that. So it's one of those. And we'll get into that where you made a pinch run, uh, by the way. Um, but you know, it's it's it, it's 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 you made and you said it right. He goes, it's not about me. It's about the team. I need to make a decision for the team. What's best for the team? Not what's best for you, the pitcher, the batter, the 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 second baseman, the center field. What's best for you and your stats? No. What's best for the team? So I think, I think you know, it took a lot of courage to to do what you did, and and I, and I think based on the results that I think that your 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 players should understand that you had to make that tough choice and, and, and it was for the best and, and you and you won. You got the championship, you know? Well definitely right. sounds like the right move, right? For sure. Yeah. Uh, it and it's even tougher, you know, you, you say that everybody has a part, but it's even more difficult as the manager to try to try to figure out what part that is and when it should be and when it should not be. Yeah. And it's tough. You it know? is, it is. But Sometimes you get questioned on the moves you make, and especially if it doesn't go the right way. But if it does, then you look like a genius, right? And yeah. then you win championships. Uh, yeah, you win championships. Can I, you know. Can I tell you? Can yeah. I tell you a little bit about that? Yeah. It's gonna be. It's gonna be. I, I just want to tell you a little bit about that. Uh, yeah. Bang. 
every like like I say every like like I just say you're right right everybody gotta make a, make a part everybody gotta make a part everybody gotta make a part on the other team right yeah and uh, I got really good players they got a good idea they got knowledge about the team right they got a knowledge about uh, about uh, baseball games whatever uh, I gotta listen them but hey I I cannot do what every play you say right yeah so i gotta take my own decision my own choice so what else, that that's what i'm being trying to do I, I don't try to be like like do something like 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 hey i'm I gonna make this new on the like like, like try like do something new right and see if it's worth if it's not on the on the championship no why y'all see it on the championship is what i'm been working on the whole season the season i take the season to, to, to fix things, fix problems, work with my team. The whole season, I'm mean, work with him, working with him the whole season, whole season. What they did to Ramones on the last game, they they, they never been do. They, they do that on the semifinal with, with Cardinals, but games before, the the game they lost, uh, like the, the team against me, right, made me four runs, I made two for two, Oh, the game finished like that. They they can make two runs. I say, but y'all got going on. Y'all cannot make two runs. It's the first inning. Y'all wanna lose already. They never made two runs. Uh, that worried me, right? I say we go. Y'all think it'll go to the. Y'all think it go to the championship, but y'all know how to do it. Y'all know how to do it. Come back, man. So y'all starting loss. Uh, y'all finish like that, right? It's how y'all wanna do it? Uh, I start working on that because I really go with it. Because that type of game, do that, right? So. With Cardinales, Anastar lost the game 1-0. It was a seven inning, 1-0, still 1-0. I said, what? I changed it. almost the whole team, seven players. I move everybody, go to the bench, go to the bench. I bring the people who was on the bench. You know how many runs they made? Yeah. Five on oh, that wow. inning. So it's how it went, 5-1, right? I'm not scared of Mason moves because the people I got on the bench, I tell, hey, we 16 players. Everybody can't play, but because y'all on the bench, don't worry about it. I know y'all good, probably better on the people on the field, right? So everybody going to play here, don't worry about it. So whenever I call you, just do the job. Be so exactly, exactly, do the job. They ready, yeah. they, they, they with me on that, right? They, they, they with me on that. They know everybody got a part. So they, they on the bench and they have to say, hey, coach, don't worry about it, man. We know we, whenever you call, I'm not going to do the job, whatever. And, well, well, that's what you got to do, right? Complacency kills. You, you get comfortable, and all of a sudden, you're not performing, and you got to shake it up a little bit. You know that that's why right. they're subs, right? Yeah, no, I, I think uh, you go zero for ten, right? You're gonna change your socks or something, aren't you? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I mean, you, you're gonna you're gonna do something different, you know. So I I I you know um, a lot of do what Daniel's saying kind of resonates, right? I mean, it's it's, it's 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 he's he's saying hey man one i gotta make the hard decisions i gotta do what's best for the team um it may not make sense to you but i'm telling you this is the right move and then he's also saying hey man there's 16 players trust me your, your time is gonna come but when your time comes you better be ready to perform uh, yeah i need you to perform and, and 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 you know i've said that before and i and i, and I that guys who come off the bench you gotta be ready i know it sucks that you pull some guy in the sex seventh inning like hey i need you to come pinch hit and you're like, dude, I haven't took any swings. I'm like, oh, well, hey, hey. Let's. Well, that, that's why they don't say pinch hitter is <laughs> the hardest position in baseball, right? Yeah, man. Hey, you got one shot. Go, go, go get it. <laughs> go get it and do it. And and you got and you got to motivate those people. You got um, a 33 percent chance. So yeah, go do it. Right? Go do it. Hey, yeah. I will tell you. I will tell you something. Y'all might go remember for a long time that was happened with Cardinalis, because I got a special guy on my team, right? And he's. It's, it, it, you know, hey, I know I cannot tell you everything tonight, man, because it's a lot of thing. I, I know, I know it's a lot of thing, right? I, I, I want to tell you everything on the whole, <laughs> on the, what I did on the whole season. I know that is possible, yeah. but let me tell you on the, you know, it might go take a minute, man. It's not going to take long. Okay. But this is very important, man. I got I got a guy on my team, right? He been doing good. He been doing good, and he's a good guy. But the problem is with, with his mind, right? If he, the blue say, "Hey, the, that that that's a strike," I say, "Oh, it's ball. Hey, it's a strike. Hey, man, calm down." I hear no listen, no but man. I say, "Hey, that guy open on the bench, and he's a good hitter." 
but he opened on the bench and he don't know why if he's a good hitter what i am open on the bench man and i'm good hitter yeah and he hey hey coach what inning it is i say yeah that's right for inning damn the game going fast yeah you're right game going fast. Like, <laughs> he tried to tell me man he tried to tell me man i want to play i said come down hey when the time coming when the time coming right i told him hey listen to me for a second hey you got good conditions, man. You are strong. I believe you. you got a good swing, man, on the practice. Man, if you do what you do on the practice, if you do it in here, man, the home run is go coming all the time, man, because you can do it, bro. But, hey, it's on your mind. Be focused, man. Be focused. Please, can you listen to me? Hey, coach, I'm going to do it. Don't worry about it. He goes to the home play. That, you know what happened? It's for a strike. The other one, the, 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 other, the ball is go. Two down, second strike. He started arguing, arguing with the blue. I said, "Man, <laughs> what am I tell you, bro? Go down, man. What, what, what are we talking about? Hey, go. You're right. You're right. The other, the other ball is coming. Worse and that one. Can you tell me what he did? He swung. Home run. He hit, all he hit a home run <laughs> oh, to wow. the left field with the worst ball. I said, it's on your mind. You hit a home run with the worst ball. His fourth home run. I've been seeing on the whole season. You know, that's what I'm been trying to do with the, with, with my guys. Work Good. within personal. So yeah. that way, you know, they can understand everybody got a part. I'm sorry about that, man. So no, 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 no. That, that, no, that's a good that's a good story because it it it, it it's a it's a good uh, sh to show an example on how you had to motivate that player and that player needed to listen to you. And what you everything you said was correct. I mean, the, the guy has to be a team player. He has to wait for his time on his bench, and he's got to quit arguing the damn balls and strikes, you know, and and, and, and concentrate on the game and, and, and uh, wait for the pitch and, and, and believe in himself. So, no, I think that's a good that's a great story. I mean, those are the those are the things that we want to hear on the show, you know. If anything, those wild pitches or whatever, strikes but not strikes, probably helped him. He's probably thinking, well, i got to swing at anything, right? <laughs> so I'm swinging for the fences this next ball. <laughs> Where does it go? It right go, over the fence. Right over the fence, man. So, so if anything, it worked yeah. to his advantage. It did. It did. I mean, it, it's and, – and, but that's that's what you have to do sometimes. You have to calm down the player a little bit and say, hey, man, you're, you're a good ball player, but, you know, you got you got to take a step back and – you know, there's no reason to be arguing balls and strikes. Um, I remember that you had pinched run, I think, in the second game. You pinched run some players. What was your strategy there? You're talking about with the, with the uh, yeah, wrong you, players, what say? Yeah, yeah, pinch running. Like, I think you took was there some, a guy on second or something? Yeah, I think he had he had a guy on second. I think he, he, he substituted him in for somebody else because I think they were a faster runner or something like that. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. That, that happened to me. I got everybody against me, okay? My <laughs> players, uh, my brother, because my brother is a like, like short guy, right? Yeah. He really fast, he really fast, right? So uh, that was that was happening. I, I I deal with the guy on 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 second baseman, right? On second baseman because that was for for Nelson. Nelson got injury on his knees, right? So yeah. I say, hey, uh, you cannot run. So I put that guy on second base. When I see my third hitter. He hit the ball right, and he making on force. Uh, that guy is my to hit, but he's heavy, man. And that one, that one is gonna be the run was supposed to tie the game, right? Yeah. That run tie the game on, on inning eight, tie the game. But he's my to hit. When I say, hey, go to the bench, hey, bro. I tell my brother, uh, Jordan is hey, let's right, come here, man. You got to run. You got to run. He say, no, no. I said, why you say no? Uh, the hitters say, man, it's crazy. No, no, no. Everybody know. Hey, man, he got crazy. He he's, he told to his tour hitter, go to the bench. I say, he not going to hit anymore. It's the inning eight. Yeah. He hit. That's yeah. him, man. Yeah. Hey, you know, my brother come, hey, man, man come here, bro, man. Come on here, man. Go to the first bay and run, man. You gotta run. <laughs> Why y'all gotta run? Let me do it, man. I've been doing the whole season. Let me do it right now. Let me do my job. All right, I, I made all the moves one behind the other one like that. It's, it's look like crazy, but that's what I like. My my crazy move. You know, <laughs> it's work. It's work. Yeah, work. My crazy move work. I'm yes, it did. Move. All right, I put that guy over there against everybody. You know who else? <laughs> That that run tied the game, man. When, when the guy hit the fence, my brother come all the way 
from the fourth base to the home play. They threw to the home play, and it was at the same time. If Yano made that move and never tied the game, we probably still play right now. <laughs> yeah, play. I don't know. Yeah. Getting ready for Sunday again, yeah. It's, it's no. not it's easy to so. score from first. No, it's not. You got you know. you to gotta be fast. You have some endurance. So, you know, and, 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 and that's that was good, man. I mean, I think that was a, that was a smart idea. And like you said, it's a crazy move, and, 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 it, and it panned out. And, and, of course, like you said, hey, the guy, he's not going to bat it already in the eighth inning. You know, yes, he, my brother, like you said, your brother's not a batter, right? He can't hit, so who cares because he's not going to come back up on the lineup. So I think um, – um, you know, you did you did a good you did something smart right there. Yeah. No. no. <laughs> hey, who who's uh, who's Jonathan Aguilar? He's cracking me up over here. Um, but um, you know, uh, you know the um, the the other thing, Daniel is um. We're focusing. We're staring. We're focusing. Yeah. <laughs> no, no. We we can we don't we don't, and 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 I want to say I want to say a couple of things to one. I want to thank Jordan for reaching out to you and getting getting a hold of you to put us in contact so that we could put you on the show. And and uh and two, um I appreciate you doing this in English, you know, because I, I had when I had when I talked to Jordan, I said, "Hey man, you know, I was at the game. I don't think I heard anybody speak English over there, man. I want to put them on the show. I want to I want them to talk about their game, but I said, does anybody over there speak English?" So, I I appreciate you, you know, practicing and doing this in English for us. Um, I could I could understand almost everything you're saying, so I, I I kept up with everything you're saying, and I think you said a lot of good things in this. I mean, hopefully there's managers and and and, and players that are listening to what exactly you're saying, and 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 soak it in because you you actually dropped a lot of good knowledge that I I definitely practiced when I was managing, and 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 I definitely agree with what you're doing. Hey, talk to your guys in Spanish too if you want. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> They're still on. Esos son mis caballos, esos son mis caballos, todo. Ganaron, ellos ganaron, mis caballos ganaron. It's like I say, uh, they, they, they my horse, man. They, they my winners. They, they win this, so they, make, they make it. You know what I'm saying? So they, they my MVP, man. And I I'm still need some more, some more MVP trophy, man, because I got 16 MVP on my, on my team, man. Yeah, yeah. they did. Yeah, no, you, you, you had, you had a great team, man, and, and uh, I, I enjoyed watching the game, and, you know, I was there. Um, I was there with uh, with Jesse James watching the game, and you know, we had a good seat up front. And um, you know, it was it was it was. I enjoyed talking to Jesse about the game. You know, the, the the different things that you were doing. And I remember sitting there, and 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 you know, when you guys were losing three to zero, Jesse James looks at me and he goes, "This game is going to be decided in the seventh, eighth, and ninth inning. This is what this is. It's not over till then." that's where it's going to be tight. And sure enough, when you guys coming back in the eighth and, and, and took the lead, it just made a huge, a huge difference. So, um, you know, I'm glad you guys kept fighting. I'm glad you kept, you know, pushing your players to, to do better. And, you know, everything you said tonight, man, is, is, I think is on point. I think you're going to have a really good season. Um, the hot shots said they're coming back in, in summer. So, you know, you, the Ramones, Hot Shots, uh, <laughs> Cuba, JS Texas. I mean, right, it's going right. to be a crazy league it's gonna next year. It's going to be a good season, huh? It's going to be a wild season. <laughs> They're going to be coming yeah, for yeah, you. Yeah. They want that trophy, you know? So. Hey, we're ready, man. We're ready. I tell you now, once I, I tell you, we're ready. We're awesome. Ready. Awesome. Yeah, you got to get used to that target on your back now. Yeah. <laughs> coming for you. Yeah, yeah. Um. So um, I don't want to keep you up too late, uh, Daniel. Pero, what you got anything else that you want to put out there before before we let you go? Oh man, uh, you know, I don't know what I'm saying. I don't say the whole night, but anyway, man. Hey, uh, for any for any manager, for any manager, whatever you know, what I'm saying for what what I can say, man, is the only thing is is nothing special. It's nothing special because let me tell you something. I don't know nothing about baseball. I've never been play baseball. I'm, I start play baseball in here. I'm, I in Cuba. I never play baseball. I got in here when I was 18 years. I got 28. I start playing different leagues in here. The I watch a, a guy, a coach, great coach. I really respect him. He's a Jose with high class. Yeah. I see how they play over there, man. They listen, they players. Uh, they don't do what the player says when they want, but they listen and they deem, uh, I tell him, I say, hey, that, that, that's work. I go listen my players. I go do the same thing. I go listen my players. I don't go do exactly what they say. I go take their ideas so that way I can figure out. And I tell, I told my players, you know what happened on my first game on the league? 
on my first game, a guy, Oscar, my center field, he said he got a lot of experience. He's a great, 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 great player. Uh, I told him, hey, mate, hey, mate, uh, can, can, hey, man, can, can you make me a line note, man? <laughs> hey, hey, make, make a line note because I don't know how to do it, man. He started helping me out. When we play with Ramones on the regular season, yeah. He try to help me out. I don't let him let help me. I say no, don't help me because if I don't eat it, man, we gonna go. We not gonna be a champion. He not help me or no. I went again. I say we champion. So <laughs> that that's what I say to the, any coach, man. Just listen to players, man. To y'all players, don't think like you know everything. No, just listen to y'all players, man. Take the decision. You know when you gotta take a decision, just take a decision, man. So that's what I've been doing. Man. Well, that's, it that's sounds like you gotta figure it out. Yeah, he's got. He's got to figure it out. I got it. I got yeah, it. Got awesome, it. man. It. Awesome, man. That's good. I think a lot of people, um, you know, are gonna learn from this, from this, from this show tonight. Uh, they'll probably rewind it and listen to it again, so they can, you know, take down some notes because you said a lot of good things, and um, and I'm, you know, I'm glad that um, you know, that Jose from the Cyclones, you know, uh, you know, mentored you a little bit, and um. You know, we'll you know we'll see we'll see how this good luck to you this season, man. And and you know, I'll definitely you know uh, look forward to, to to seeing you on the field. And I definitely want to shake your hand next time I see you. So um, I don't know when that's gonna be because I play baseball too, but I play in a different league. But I just want you to know. I just want you guys all to know that I didn't go to my game, which I know my coach doesn't want to hear that. But I didn't go to my game. It's okay. He's not in here <laughs> to go to go to go uh, film this one and watch this one. So. Um, you know, sometimes you got to make some sacrifices, but it was, it was a great game. You guys gave us a good game and, uh, you know, good luck to you guys this season and, and, you know, stay healthy. And, uh, uh, I guess we'll, we'll talk later. Hey man, I appreciate it. I really appreciate it. Uh, to y'all, man, uh, bring me to, to this postcard here, man. Uh, I, like I say, I'm really excited. I really, really, really appreciate it, man. That, that. That's my first time in my life, man. So this like, like, like they say, hey, you go to Telemundo. I say, really? Hey, I go to Telemundo. I'm nervous. <laughs> motherfucker. Really. I'm sure about the world. <laughs> but that's what happened to me, man. Hey, hey, I appreciate y'all too, man. Okay. Really, really, I, awesome. I, I just want to say thank you, man. Okay, y'all have a good night. And I'll see y'all this season, man. Sounds good. Talk right, to you later. Yeah, yeah. Con- okay. Congratulations. All right. Thanks. All right. Bye-bye. Bye. Man, you know, um... I think, uh, I think, I mean, that was a really good interview. I mean, he really had a lot to say. I mean, I think he had some really good points, honestly. I mean, I think uh, I really didn't expect that. And first, first time being a coach, and he said he hadn't been playing baseball well, for that long. Well, what I, I didn't expect that. Being from Cuba, never played there. And, yeah, uh, right. Just starting out when he came here. Yeah. yeah. I mean, it's, it's, uh, yeah, it's crazy, huh? <laughs> Like yeah, you think those guys have baseballs in their hands as a toddler, right? Yeah, but, yeah. Uh, ev- evidently not. Yeah, I mean, it's, 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 yeah. When but that he, goes to show you, anybody can learn, anybody can, can, can be good at it, right? You know, yeah. if you've been doing it for a long time, it helps, right? It does, it does help. But uh, if you put, put in the work, you can do well, you know, you can un- learn about the game, understand it, and, and, and know, know what to do as a manager, you know, do this, do that, and you get a championship to show for it. Yeah, I mean, yeah, he got, he had his championship yeah. first time around, man, <laughs> so... I definitely my my hat goes off to him, and, and you don't even need to speak English. Yeah, so. I mean, I mean, it, you know, I always said baseball is not it is not a is not there's you don't need a, it's not a language, right? It's its own language in a sense, right? You don't need to speak English or anything. It could be any language. You just got to know how to play baseball. So it's universal. Um, and you know, he 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 man, he took him to he took him to the promised land, man. First first time around, it was pretty cool. So congratulations to them. Um, so what we got this this uh, this last this Friday, right? Let's we we'll start Friday off with the HB or HHL uh, or what? Let, let's do HBA. HBA. Let's go with HBA. Then. Did you say you had to be fast to score from first? You said that right earlier. I did. Okay, thank you. I'm just making sure. Thank you. Thank <laughs> you you, you got to be lightning fast. <laughs> Great, thank you. <laughs> Blistering speed. Blistering speed. Okay, that's that's what it. I thought. That's Thanks. it. So yeah. Uh let's get into uh Saturday, right? Yeah, Saturday, man. Uh HBA Marlins and Hellcats. Ooh, fourteen to one Marlins. Wow. Um Hellcats still struggling, but you know, it's tough when you need all those guys at the trials. Right, right. Although they did want win. They beat the Avengers, I think, last week, so Okay. Maybe the week before. Uh Bennett had a home run. Again, wow. Yeah. 
Again. <laughs> yeah, again. It was again. It yeah. was again. He's, I, I still got to post it up. Um, I'll probably post it up tomorrow. The Pirates beat the Twins four to three. Which that was a that was a good game. We man. skated we skated by, right? Yeah, I mean, I think that was that was a. That I was, think Corey just kept he popped us up like eighteen times. And, and and you know that goes back to what I've said before. You know, you don't have to throw ninety or eighty five or whatever to be an effective pitcher. You just got to place your pitches just right and get and let the batters get themselves out. You know, so I mean, he did, he did a hell of a job. I mean, we easily, you know, we could have easily put the ball in play in in the in the gaps, but. For some reason we couldn't get him in the gaps. We pop it up or ground out or something. So he did a he did a hell of a job. Yeah, but we got the W. Yeah, uh, we did. The Rangers beat the Ironbirds ten to six. They did have a home run. Bo Gilbo. Okay. Bo Gilbo, who's also a pitcher, but I don't think he pitched. Um, boy, the Rangers look good. Yeah. What would you say? Who did they beat again? They beat the Ironbirds, oh. which is not an easy team to beat. It's not. Yeah. It's not. The Padres beat the Shooters 10-2. Uh, no home runs there. The Colt 45 shut out the Avengers 14 to nothing. Wow. Yeah. I don't know what's going on with the Avengers. It's not their season, man. No. No. Uh, there was a home run by the 45s. Probably going to mess this up. Badi Laba. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds good, man. I don't right? Even... Yes, yes. I'm pretty confident on the first name, but Badi. Badi. Okay. Yeah. Anyway, must have been a shot. Uh, Aviators won again, ten to four against the Braves. Okay. Yeah, they're one of the four and one teams. Uh, no home runs there. And then the Cyclones beat the Redbirds. Savani went yard for the Cyclones, of course. I heard, um, I think uh, Bo posted that um, they they went they had to go ahead run again with uh, with another Bach. Oh, is that right? <laughs> yeah, except the ball didn't drop this time, but it was a Bach. <laughs> but it's huh. uh, it looks like the Redbirds scored five runs in the seventh, but it wasn't enough. Hmm. I'm sure the Cyclones had seven errors. Wow. Yeah. But, you know, when you score 13 runs, sometimes it doesn't matter. <laughs> <laughs> they definitely got good offense, man. Yeah, and, and, and that's sure. one of those things that I think we've we've kind of known with the Cyclones, right? you got to keep up with them, right? If your pitcher is not going to if your pitcher is not gonna hold it down, right, or your defense is not going to hold it down, then your offense better just be keeping up with them. They scored three, you better score three. They scored two, you better score two, you know, yeah. keep up with them. So. And it looks like Stewart was scrambling a little bit. Oh, we got one, two, three, four, five, six pitchers for the Redbirds. Wow. I mean, talk about a bunch of calls of the bullpen. And, you know, and and it's and I'm kind of interested why. I mean, now I'm interested. You know, I don't think I've ever seen that before yeah. in, in one of our games. It's quite a few. Yeah. I wonder if it was just they weren't doing what they were supposed to or, or they got hurt maybe. Normally, you just see one name up there. Yeah, right. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Huh. Well, like I said, um, <clears throat> four, six, I think six teams for the um, – Four and one. Six wow. teams are tied four and one. What six teams are those? One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, that'd be the Rangers, Marlins, Colt 45, Padres, Aviators, and Redbirds. So no one's undefeated. But, I mean, a lot of good teams. A lot of good competition. Yeah, a lot of good competition, man. Let's move to Sunday. Let's get this over with. Um, you didn't play Sunday, no. Man. So you can't give us any insight, no insight. on the loss. <laughs> I I do cannot. Okay, I cannot, man. Uh, but something interesting did happen. The, the yard goats lost, only by one run. So the Aces beat them nine to eight. Congratulations to the Aces, man. Yeah. I mean, that's not an easy feat, you know. So. It's not, but it's not the playoff, so not really a big deal. <sighs> I agree. I agree. Yep. I agree. All these teams, like yeah, you might get a you might get a W against these, but they, they turn it they, t they turn it up to another level when it's playoff time. Right, or the elimination game, like we saw. Right, the first game, fourteen to four, whatever. Okay, we're not gonna win this one. Let off, but the next one, five to four. Yeah, it's a different story. Different story. Yep. So Cyclones lost to the Naturals, six to two. And that's Corey's team. 
Yes, that's Corey's team. Yeah, man. So he he lost Saturday but won on Sunday. And um, you know, I don't know. I have no idea what happened there, but I know I know. I can tell you this is. Well, it looks like Coulter just got hit. He pitched all seven innings, gave up nine hits on oh, wow. five runs. Hmm. But he did have eleven strikeouts. Really? Yeah. Was there any errors in there? There were three errors by the Cyclones. Not too bad. Not too bad. Yeah. Yeah. But uh, they out hit you guys nine to seven. Hmm. Man, which could have been that. And the Bobcats lost to the whatever coastal team six to two. Um. My understanding was the Apollos. The Apollos. Which you know they're a good team, so no surprise there, I guess. But I, I would have expected a higher score actually, <laughs> yeah. to be honest. But um, hey. Um. So it, remind me again. Any coastal team could be playing. Any coastal team. So just whatever. Just run throws up. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. All right. Uh, let's do the hardball three sixty five, shall we? Yes, sir. The Vaqueros beat the Hitmen 8-7. to seven. And actually, I, I caught the end of that. It was a really good game. Was it? All right, so the the tying run for the Hitmen was trying to tag up on a, on a, a pop-up. Yeah. Right? Fly ball. It was deep enough, but he made the throw. Tagged him out at home. Game over. Vaqueros win. Wait, he was at, what you say, at third or second? Third. The okay. tying run was at third. Third, okay. Right? On, uh, I guess, well, two outs or one out. Uh, fly ball, left field, catches it, and the runner on third tries to tag to score the tying run. Left fielder throws him out from left field. Now, did did was the runner slow, or did he have good speed? I can't really comment on that <laughs> <laughs> because I, I didn't see it until after it was done. I got you, got you, got you. <laughs> so it was, just, it, it was a good throw, and he got him out. It had to be a good throw. It had to be there, right? For, well, okay. Well, it, it wasn't a relay. It wasn't. It was. Let me ask you this. And I and I and I'm. It, it may have bounced four times, but I don't. <laughs> right? If if it beats the runner and it's an out, it's got to be a semi good throw. Well, it was on point, right? I mean, that's that's the important part. Like, it could have bounced ten times, but as long as it was straight in, into home. But I just want to make sure it wasn't a a, a Dre Vapey where you you know you kind of skit sniper on the way to home plate uh, type of play. <laughs> <laughs> so. Um, I'm, I'm gonna say no. <laughs> <laughs> Love you, Dre. I'm just messing with you, bro. Yeah, but you, you know what was you funny? Had to bring that one out, I, huh? I thought you know what was funny about that is that uh, Dre was wearing um, you know those those mittens, right? And I like the hub glove or whatever. Yeah, the the sliding glove. Man. yeah, I said, come on, Dre, you don't you don't slide <laughs> fucking head first. Let's let's come on, let's be real. Nah, man, when I slide on my back, I scrape my hand. I said, okay, and then and then when he's running third and he falls. It kind of made me laugh because he went forward, like you know, like he was diving, and it's just like, hey, that's not what I meant by you know, slight head first, you know. And his hand was okay. His hand was okay. It was covered by the mitt. <laughs> so, uh, I mean, um, there, okay, there was a lot of yelling and hollering. So I'm assuming he didn't fall, okay. right? If it's an easy out, probably not going to scream and celebrate that way. Yeah, yeah, it's true. So. But either way, like you said, you got to execute the throw. You got to execute the throw. So yeah, you got to execute the catch and then the throw. Yeah. So I I don't know. Well, it, that's always a good way to end the game. It is. Yeah, it I makes mean, you feel good. Especially for left fielder, that's what they live for. All right. And it's funny because uh, there came a question: Would you rather be the hero by hitting a home run to win the game, or throwing somebody out? to win the game from like the outfield like a good play not like a regular ground out for me well the re more of the reality would be me throwing somebody out at home that'd be more of the reality than a home from run. where short short like you know it's a short you know, but that's kind of routine right yes but but again you got to execute the throw how many times have you seen the throw go off okay guy so may- yeah so if you dive you have to make a diving play and the guy's trying to score then you get up and throw him out yeah for me i i i enjoy that now i would love to hit the home run but really i don't hit as many home runs but i do there is something about throwing somebody out like when i've been part of a relay and you know somebody's trying to get third or somebody's trying to get home and yeah. then you just nail that ball right there that feels good well, you know, defense wins championships, right? Yeah. I mean, 
I guess that's why. That's what they say. Yeah. yeah. I mean, it, 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 and I've had a couple, and and it, and it and it feels good. It feels good. But, you know, um, I don't know, man. I guess maybe because not hitting a home run would be good. What would you pick? You're not fielder, so that that's gonna be. Let me ask you, because you're not fielder. Uh, yeah, I think I'd rather throw somebody out. Oh, you would? Yeah. Yeah. It's like you thought you thought you were gonna make it, huh? But yeah. no. Because <laughs> it's not routine, right? Like no. a gr- I don't want I don't want to make it seem like it's not routine when you get a ground ball and you throw somebody out at home, but it's almost like throwing the first, right? Yes, yes. And unless you're playing deep mm-hmm. or you dive for the ball and then you really have to put something on it, you know, yeah. that's a different story. Yeah. So I mean people tag up. A lot of people tag, right? Yeah. Now if it's shallow, like you're catching it at the lip of the grass, you have no business running. <laughs> It kind of takes away from it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But, I mean, uh, if you make it close and you put that, you put it on the money. Yeah. I mean, it, it's it's an exciting play, you know, for sure. Um, but well, um, I'll get through this. So the Aztecas beat the Gladiators, uh, eight to five, closer game. The Vipers won twelve to eight at Spring Spirit over the Drillers. Hmm. I mentioned Spring Spirit because this next stat is important because I see a home run. Oh. By Jesse Lopez. Okay. So in the, you put you think it in the in the park? Um, I don't know. If it's in the park, still impressive. Not as much as it is if you got it over the fence, right? Yeah, yeah. So sure. and of course I score whatever doesn't distinguish if it's inside the park <laughs> or if it goes over the fence, right? I, I mean, if I guess you could look at the uh, the statistics of the ball that was hit, right? Because you do have the option to input that. Yeah, I mean. <laughs> but I can't see that here, so. Yeah, yeah. I mean. In, if in, anybody knows, let us know, but I don't know. Yeah. Yeah. Exactly. HR, Jesse Lopez. Either way, it's a home run. Congratulations. Jimmy says that uh, what I said is what people say when they can't hit home runs. <laughs> <laughs> hey man, I'm not gonna deny it, man. I mean, not everybody can beat Jimmy fucking hitting bombs and shit. Yeah, yeah. Call shots and shit. I can't. Well, do that's that. why I said it, right? right. <laughs> we somebody else. Yeah, exactly. Uh, what did the Aztecas win? One? Did you see the Aztecas? So the Aztecas won eight to five over the Gladiators. Okay, yeah, so you did see that. And then the Lumberjacks uh, beat the. Diablo sixteen to eight. So you know you got a really good game coming up next this weekend, right? You got so that. the two undefeated teams are the Aztecas and the Lumberjacks, and so they play next Sunday. So two five and zero teams thought it'd be a good game. Oh man, it's gonna be an exciting game. Yeah, should be. Um, Might see you there. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> that's gonna be definitely a good game. I don't want to make yeah. All right. Um. So yeah, that's uh, it for HBA. And 365. However, next season, I think they're going to be under one yes. umbrella. Right? Yep. Well, well, they still kind of are, but uh, yeah. dropping the Harbaugh 365 to HPA. Yep. Should be good. Yeah. Uh, well, you know, someone asked about previewing next Saturday's game. Right. Yeah, they did. The prime time. So do, do we, don't have, we don't have HHL stuff then, I guess? Uh, Yeah. Yeah, we'll get into that. Okay. But oh, I, yeah, I see, I'm on my I, HBA tab, right? You, you want sense. me to switch tabs? No, no, you're 100% right in my back. Okay. <laughs> I, I mean, <laughs> yeah. lose my train of thought yeah, here. Yeah, yeah, it's true. I see, I, see, yeah. I see your flow. I don't know why I didn't see it. You try to get me to fumble here. Uh, so we do have the Pirates and the Padres at 10 a.m. That's going to be a good primetime morning game. <laughs> yeah, 10 a.m. I don't know about that. Jimmy, you gonna be out drinking the night before? I, I hope so. That's what I'm gonna do. We're, we're gonna get Jimmy drunk. <laughs> right. We're gonna go. Hey man, come out. Let's go get a drink, man, and just you know drop a pill in him so you can. Him and um. Carlos, he'll have some Carlos drinks, right? Carlos too. Yeah, yeah. Padres well, drink, don't they? Yeah, they do, man. It's supposed to. Yeah. It's supposed to. Well, I guess the pirates <laughs> drink too, right? <laughs> they rob That's you and they drink. <laughs> exactly. Uh, Hellcats Twins, Aviators, Redbirds. Ought to be a good game. Both four and one. Yeah, I mean, and, and and the thing is, is you know, aviators are turning it around, right? You know, you know, um, Redbirds, you know, is, is a team that's been legacy wise has been a great team. Um, aviators have kind of reconstructed, and um, you know, uh, uh, they're, they're gonna give them a fight. I mean, they they should not sleep on that team. Yeah, you know, Colt forty five and the Marlins should be a good game. I'm gonna go for the Colt forty five. Yeah, they've been playing well. <laughs> yeah, they have. That's so with the Marlins, so. Yeah, they have. 
Boy, that lefty's good. For who? The Co forty five. Okay. Who is it? Hmm? Who who's the guy from Co forty five? Lefty? I don't remember. Oh, okay. The guy that faced us for two innings. Man, I don't want to remember. Inning and a half, whatever. I don't remember that, but Okay, let's go to HHL. Okay. Unless we're previewing anything else, no? no. Thirty and up, we'll jump right into it. This is what the second week. Yeah, started on the fourteenth. Friday was week. kind of our opening day, right? I mean, that was for us. It was opening day? Well, last Friday it was. Yeah, yeah, last yeah. Friday. And what did we get? A w. Man. The champions. Yeah, oh yeah. As our opening day. Yeah, which was a great game. It was a good game. It really was. Um, you know, we have the luxury of being able to see the the Thunder day in or season in, season out, right? Yeah. Um, I think we've seen Tommy before. Yeah. I know he pitches. I think he pitches for the Padres also. Yep. But, you know, even when you see him, you know. It, well, it's not easy, right? Yeah. It's still, no. Uh-uh. <laughs> yeah, you, st- you still got to put in that word. I and, mean, you know, we didn't have to see Yusuf. So. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you, baseball guys, on that. Right. What's up, Tim Jones? Uh, but it still wasn't easy. So, Goodfellas won 10 to 8. Uh, no. And, boy, we had to fight back. We did. It, as always is the case with Thunder, right? You have to come back. You know, and... and, and Put we, up five runs in the seventh. Yes. Yeah. And, and, you know, uh, you know, it was one of those games where, like, when when we had to put... When we had to come back like that, I honestly thought the game was over. I'm like, nah, you know, this is Thunder. We're probably not going to, you know, pull ahead. But, you know, we were able to, to, to scrap some, some hits together and yeah. get on base and... and Man, it, it worked out very well. I mean, you know, you know, I was talking to to Jesse. You know, he was, you know, Jesse was the umpire, the home plate umpire. He was like, man, it was a great game, man. I enjoyed. Like he was, I had the best view in the house. I'm right back there watching everything, and he goes, it was a really good game. So, um, it's 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 a testament to the 30 and up, right? That that the league is getting better. You know, you know, uh, thanks to Carlos, you know, doing his recruiting, doing his uh, promoting of that of that division. And, um, it's becoming a, a better league. Well, we definitely have more teams, yeah. which is good. Yeah, Isaiah says I got the next one. <laughs> 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 I definitely want to face Isaiah. I've, I've I've always either watched him or been on his team, so I, I definitely want to be in that batter's box to see what that's all about. So the actual opening day was uh, the 14th. The Sul- Sultanas beat the Pelicans 11-6. to Jump over to Wednesday the 16th. The JS Texas beat the Panthers 9-7. to And then we had our game Friday. Uh, had another game Monday. Actually, it was two games Monday. Goodfellas beat the Armadillos 19-0. Sorry, Timothy. Uh, yeah, sorry, man. The Pelicans beat the JS Texas. Or beat JS Texas. I guess there's no deal. Wait, right? who, who beat the JS Texas? The Pelicans. Really? 8-7. to Must have been a good game. Jazz Texas is supposed to be, you know, Sultanes and Jazz Texas, uh, you know, we we probably don't know. I, I, I definitely know some players from each of those teams, right? But We're going to get they're, some more content the next time we play the Thunder. <laughs> <laughs> um, if it's strikeouts, we're not going to talk about it. So. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, exactly. And, uh, and you know, the, um, the, uh, the thing with the um, – JS Texas and Sultanas they're new to the league mm-hmm. and uh, and even even the Pelicans are kind of are and kind of not I mean they came back I think they were in, in HHL but yes um, I think they were 40 and up at right? one point yeah and, and um, you know it's 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 good to see you know some good teams and some and some good you know the good talent out there so we're gonna you know we're gonna uh, we're gonna find out you know what what, what this, this division is gonna be about you know now, did you you forgot to mention the triple play? We did have a triple. We did triple play. Triple play, not from not from Twin Peaks, but we're talking <laughs> about the one in <laughs> in baseball. Both really good, one better than the other. Yes, because yes. It, it's very rare. It is very rare, it, and, and it's funny because when it happened, I was playing second, so when it happened, it was kind of like in slow motion. Yeah, like the ball was hit hard to third. And that's exactly what it what it has to be. Yes, and it has to correct. be hard and close to the back. Yes, and that's exactly what it was. And yeah. that's what, and he made a great throw to second, 
And as he's throwing a second, I corner of my eye, I could still see the runner. So I'm like, oh, shoot, we still might have a chance at this. And I just, yeah. luckily, I didn't really think about it. You know, oh, shoot, I better make a good throw. I just threw it over there, and we got him out. And I was like, dude, that was a triple play. It was close by a step. Yeah, Very it was. Close. Yeah, you know, and, um, you know, in, uh, like you said, it doesn't really happen a lot. You no. know, it doesn't really happen a lot. And even the times it does, it's often a little league triple play, right? Where you get doubled off somehow and someone tries to advance, right? Yeah. It's never around the horn no. triple play. No, no, it wasn't. Yeah. And, and, and like the, said, the conditions have to be just right. Just right. And that day was, <laughs> and it was crazy. It was like, oh, we got no outs. And then, yeah. boom, like, I hit. I'm like, wow, we just ended and, the inning. Yeah, and, yeah, it, it was the we were struggling, right? Or <laughs> if we were just, okay, if we're putting guys on. That yeah, can what's going on here? Quickly get out of it. Yeah, you know Juan says don't sleep on the Pelicans. Yeah, I don't agree. I I, I mean I agree, man. You know you can't. I you don't want to sleep on anybody, really. Yeah, yeah. I mean especially you know, um, you know especially some of these new teams that we don't know nothing about. You know, yeah. And it was like Car Carlos jumped in. Yeah, any team can win the championship this season in the thirty plus. You know, and and. You you just don't know. I mean, it's it's going to be that competitive in in this in this division, and um, you know, we'll see we'll see what goes, man. I mean, you know, every you know, Thunder has a target on their back, and 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 you know, um, it was it was good. It felt good to beat the Thunder, you know. But we know that they they turn it up another level, uh, in the playoffs. Right. I mean, yeah, first game of the season. I mean, we <laughs> we did that twice with the Marauders, but it th didn't matter. Didn't matter. It didn't matter. As soon as playoffs came in, <laughs> and just like, hey. Do you forget who we were? <laughs> Apparently, you forgot who we were. So you know, it's it's a it was it was a good game, and uh, I definitely enjoyed it. Now, I do like those Cougar jerseys. Yeah, the red and black. You know, and and you know, I like Excuse black me, thunder jerseys the, that resemble the Cougars. The Cougars, and they went with the black pants. I I know a lot of people don't are not a fan of black pants. I like them because it just, I think it just it's different. You know, you got the black, you got the gray, you got the white, and then that black is just it's different you know and uh so I, i'm I, I think it's uh I, I told omar this when jimmy's up at, and he's at the bat right yeah. and, you know he's got the the black the black shirt the black pants and i'm looking i said hey doesn't he look like a like a jujitsu instructor right with the martial <laughs> arts pants and shirt. <laughs> the way he's standing up there holding the bat yeah, yeah, and definitely intimidating. I mean, you know, you know, he. Well, they uh, look like a gang, right? Yeah. Like they're about to just come after you. <laughs> the funny thing is, they, they like to hang out after the game. It's like, right? hey man, we better not walk yeah, by them. Let's don't walk by there. Let's don't walk by. They're gonna steal our. They're gonna steal our equipment. <laughs> we're about to get bullied. <laughs> yeah, yeah, we're gonna get bullied by them. Yeah, yeah. See, Juan, see, Juan calls us softball pants. I know a lot of people when they see black pants, they call them softball pants. But hey, there's no reason why they can't be baseball pants. You know, so. Um, but you know the other thing too um, uh, in the Veteranos League, um, the, uh, there's I play, you know I play for the Azteca. It's a lot of you know a lot of the Thunder plays for Azteca. A lot of guys that we know play for the Azteca, and um, we had a doubleheader. So it would have been a crazy weekend for me because we played Friday, we won that game. Monday, uh, Saturday morning, Pirates, we won that game, and the Azteca we had to play a doubleheader. Now we run ruled the first game, but the second game, I don't remember if we run ruled the second game or we went all the way nine innings. But um, it was a long day. That's three games in one day. I'm, you know, I'm beat, and I really wanted to play that Sunday game just for the endurance, just to see if I can do it, and also to get W's all the way through. Because even though I didn't play Sunday, and you know my team took a loss, but Monday. We had the Armadillos game and we get another W. So every game I was at, we won. So hey, was, me too. So yeah, it's good, right? Feels yeah, good, right, to yeah. be on the winning side of yeah. it. <laughs> well, then again, we do share some teams. So uh, had you gone to that Cyclone game, you could not be saying that, right? I know. Well, or maybe you're the difference maker. Maybe yeah, difference maker. Right, six right. to two. Maybe you hit a grand slam and then boom. <laughs> I just tie I tied the I I, I called the inner energy of a uh, Jimmy and just yeah. hit a grand slam all of a sudden, right? Mm -hmm. um, but uh, you know, it's it's a um, it, it was a, definitely a great, great, um, great uh, day for baseball. It was and a good weekend if you're going to play four or five games. Oh, right? man, yeah. And, it, and, and it, was, it was a great, great weekend. And, you know, the, the Aztecas, you know, us, we pulling off the, the, those two games, you know, was was good. And, and um, I think um, I think we're playing the, the Cardinals next week, another doubleheader. So, yeah, we're going to play three games again this Saturday, too. <laughs> So it's gonna it's it's gonna suck and um 
I don't know, Juan, I don't remember, I, n I don't remember, Juan plays from Team Mexico, so I'm not sure, that's his team, so I'm not sure if they, um, I don't think he posted the standings yet um, on, on the Veterans League uh, social media, but I think, I, I don't know if they're still in it or, or, or they're one and one, if they got a third game, they got to play or something, but there's double elim elimination, so, yeah. and uh, next week's game's supposed to be really good, and what's kind of interesting is we're going to play against some uh, gamblers. Right, I mean Thunder and all the guys gamblers. There's gonna be uh, some gamblers on your team, so I'm like, oh, it's gonna be interesting because I'm like, hey, I seen you pitch, I seen you hit. Now I get to play against you, so yeah, it it's always fun, right? Like we we talked about, you got you 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 got a lot your teammates one day, and then your opponents the next day. You know, Thunder game, right? We we there was a lot of Ironbirds in there, right? Our 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 our, our coach and our manager for for good fellas is 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 Ironbird, but mm -hmm. we're playing against Ironbirds, and so it's just um. Makes it's, it fun. It does make it fun. Yeah. It does make it fun. It's, it, and also, it's hard to get mad at one another <laughs> if the kid gets out of hand, right? It is. It well, is. I can't go punch him because I play with him, right? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh, oh, we're playing the Indios. I'm sorry. Yeah, we're playing the Indios. That's what Juan says. And he said everybody swept except Mexico versus Tiger. So they were able to stay alive. So they play 1-1. One, one, so they'll be you know playing Sunday and then... I assume that we're going to play the 3 o'clock game, and then whoever wins that game will play whatever team at 6 o'clock. So um, it's going to, you know, you know, they're going into the um, they're going into the playoffs. Yeah, yeah, I, I, we were watching that Indios game, and they swept the Dodgers, and, um, I mean, they were just beating up on those guys, and, and it, was, it was, you know, a fairly good game. I mean, ours weren't, weren't, weren't all that special either. I mean, it, it, it you know, we were seeing pitching that was very slow, so what you have to sit back and you got to try to adjust. You got to try to adjust. Yeah. So it was. If you're um, good, you can adjust. Yeah. But if you're me, you just try. <laughs> <laughs> no, believe me. The first game we had that day, I was struggling, and then I was able to get my bat together in the second yeah. game and turn it around. But uh, you know, it was you, you're able to have fun with it. You know, so it worked out pretty good. Um, so the the forty and up HHL. Um, Looks like it's struggling with only four teams. And I don't see the Cyclones on here. So I'm wondering oh. what's up with that. You know, we got the Hurricanes, which they're 3-0. <laughs> uh, no surprise there, right? Yeah. Uh, Storm, Panthers, and the Angels. So it looks like there's really only three games played so far. But, yeah, I don't I don't see the Cyclones in the 40 mm. up. Maybe 35? He does still do the 35. I think the Marauders on it. There's a Marauders 35 Yeah, on Joe there. has a Marauders team there. Yeah. And then uh, Dean does have the Cyclones there. Okay, does he? Okay. Yeah, there's five. Teams? Mm -hmm. The Hurricanes there. Astros, Cyclones, Marauders, and Expos. I don't I You got more on the Sunday than you do during the weeknight. Yeah, it's a little harder, I guess. Yeah. I mean, you know, driving all the way to Mason at 730... Drive it kind of sucks. Yeah, it, you know, that should change the next couple of weeks. I know our next two games are at Anderson, which make does make it easier. But mm -hmm. I know we have to go back to Mason. Yeah. And yeah, then you got to deal with the headlights. Yeah, I hate that. Face. You know, I'm sitting thinking people I, everywhere. Yeah, I was thinking, hey, man, they build little gunshots. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll, I was. I think if they build little pony walls by the parking lot, that yeah. would obviously protect us. Or if they put, you know, uh, fencing, you know, on the on the fence, something to block the, on the wood or something. Yeah. That would definitely help. But it, yeah, it sucks, man. When you're an infielder and those headlights are are hitting you in the face, man, it really sucks. So. Or the outfield. Can you, does it bother you from the outfield? Too? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Well, sure. But depending on where the car is, yeah, for sure. Yeah. Yeah. Definitely. It definitely sucks. So. Um, 55 and up, one, two, three, four, five, six. They got seven teams. Who? 55 and up. Really? Yeah. They're What's up, Kyle? About their second week, second, third week. Wow, 55, man. Yeah. 55. We do, are, we still, are we doing 55, Cody? Are we going to continue into 55? It depends on how many surgeries I have to have between <laughs> now and then. <laughs> <laughs> uh, hey, but it felt good to bring the Toros back, right? It did, yeah. It did. Yeah, it was cool, man. Bring the turtles back, you know. It was uh, four, five, slash six of us. Yeah. Yeah, you know, we we look like it looked like that they joined us, right? Right. <laughs> but um, you know, especially just, representing with the jerseys. Yeah, nice jerseys too. Yeah. 
Yeah, Goodfellas is, is a... Is and you a, got a chance to wear yours. I, I finally did in-game. I finally did. <laughs> right, not around town. Because <laughs> that's all I was doing, right? Being a poser. <laughs> so, um, see, let's see. Juan says, one more season playing at Anderson before the city shut us down permanently. Yeah, you know what? We were talking about that. Yeah. You know, um, I was talking about Jesse James. Um, and... Um, you know, was talking about, you know, when they're going to shut that park down. And so I guess, yeah, he said this season, oh, man, it's going to suck. Yeah. Man, it's going to suck. Anderson was a, was a good field, man. And it, it's conveniently located. It is. In my opinion. It is. I wonder if we could scrap, take the Especially lights with us. Especially if you're Dane and you live right next to the damn thing. <laughs> Does he? And he's still late, probably. Yeah. Um, hey, I wonder if we can, I wonder if Coastal can go snag those little head, uh, those uh, lights and take them over to the field. Uh, don't you have any city connections? Like... <laughs> With uh, some, they're probably gonna go to auction, right? That's true. Yeah. So it, somebody, somebody get uh, get a hold of Dunn, tell him to go, go bid on those those uh, lights for the field. Yeah. Uh, yeah, but they're gonna do something with the lights. I mean, I know. Well, that, it is a shady part of town. Let's just steal them. <laughs> <laughs> one last thing we gotta dis- one last thing we gotta take down, right? Yeah, you probably send somebody a letter. They'll probably just tell you, well, you take them down, they're yours. <laughs> and then he's somebody. Yeah. Yeah, Tim says uh, he's, uh, he said I hope I can still uh, throw my arm at 55. Uh he's gonna be playing 65 in up tournaments. <laughs> Dude, can you can you can you imagine Tim Jones with that arm at 55? It will be so unfair. Like you know, just Tim Jones just like wiping my right. I don't know. If he loses 10 miles an hour, it's still gonna be unfair. Yeah, for sure, for sure, man. Oh man, we're still gonna be fearing uh, Tim Jones at 50 in the, in the 55 and up league. <laughs> oh man. That's good, man. Yeah. Well, maybe at that point, everybody starts falling off, right? And so, really, you only have, like, 15 guys or 65 who still want to play. <laughs> oh, man. That's but forgot. not when you look at seven teams. Man. Well, I mean, it's 55, but still. We need, we need just just for uh, research purposes, we need to go out and look at one of those games one time and just go watch yeah. our future, our future selves. Well, you know, I used to help coach a 65, 60 and 65 year old team out of San Antonio, and I got to see what it's like. Is it pretty? Actually, yeah, because oh. it was a, t- a traveling tournament team. Also pretty good. It was actually pretty good. Nice. Yeah. The 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 throwing was good. The hitting was good. The running not so much. <laughs> Maybe like a handful of guys, right? But at that point, you know, you're some guys just, you know, they don't stay in shape. You can still hit the ball when you're overweight, but it's hard to get around the bases <laughs> unless you hit a home run. <laughs> oh man, can you imagine? Can you imagine how long would be in 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 the in the in park uh, home run? Like just like I mean, because you hit it hard enough yeah. to where that now the outfielder has to go get to it. Right, uh, but then this guy has to run all the way. Well, I, don't, I don't know. Here's the thing: is that like a 15 minute road jog around? But the ratio might be the same, right? Because if the guy ran around the bases is slow, maybe the outfielder is just as slow, and it's taking him longer to get to the ball. So it, there, it could be a close play at home. But now he has to make that throw. Four cutoffs, maybe five cutoffs. Well, like I <laughs> the said, the whole team has to line up. It's the running is the issue. <laughs> the throwing, not so much for most for okay. the most part. Yeah. All right. So not so not so you don't think you need like a three person four person okay well maybe <laughs> maybe three person cut out yeah okay um all right man I think we're are we good Cody anything uh, else anything we're missing not unless you have any other leagues I think we hit them all man shoot we're hitting them all and I and I appreciate everybody who's sending me their info um you know I think I had uh, Liga Internacional uh, send me some info too. Somebody reached out to me. Okay. Uh, that's that screenshot I sent yep, you. Yep, yep. Um, so I appreciate uh, you know other leagues you know we sending got, us. So we're gonna get stats on them soon. We'll see. I, there, I think um, I think everybody they're starting to see other leagues kind of participate in the social media and adding stuff. You know, so I think that um, it would just boost other leagues, right? You know, like I said, like the veterans. You know, Juan I think is running the. Um, I mean, his dad's running the veterans league, but. Juan, I think, is running the social media page. And so, you know, he's putting up the schedule. He's putting up the scores and the standing. So hopefully, you know, these other leagues kind of, kind of participate in that. And we'll definitely be able to share it and, and, and talk about it and, and, you know, whatever. So um, we'll see how it goes. Cool. Okay. Well, 
appreciate everybody staying on i know it's late and we we went uh we went up pretty high this this we went up to like almost uh 40 i think and then we went back down to 10. Well, that tells us it's it's, it's, it's time. time to go it's yeah. time it's time to go all right <laughs> good night all right